Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Enoch Petroselli, male witch and author. And for those of you who are new to my channel, I welcome you as well. Today I'm doing a quick channeling of Azazel, the Demon King. Azazel is um, one of the chief watchers. He is, and the watchers are a group of fallen angels that are mentioned in the Book of Enoch. Azazel is a bearer of the black flame. He illuminates the consciousness of men, he, um, men and women, um, and he gives them individual will. Even though man and women are one with the universe, their will counts. It's a part of the universe. So um, the black flame means that your say matters too. It's not just um, do what the universe says. It's I'm going to put forth my will into the universe in addition to the will of the universe. And it's kind of a balance that happens. If that makes sense. That's kind of my understanding of what the black flame is. Um, but anyway, today we're going to be channeling Azazel. And I talked to him. He came to me yesterday and said he had messages for you guys and for me. So I'm going to have him come through and see what he has to say today. Um, <clears throat> for those of you who are unfamiliar with my, with my work, uh, check out my books. I'll put links in the description below. And for my newest sigils, chants, and affirmations, check out my Patreon. I'll put a link in the, the description below as well for that. Um, with that said, we'll get right into this channeling. Um, I do want to mention that my style of channeling is one of a light trance. And uh, the, the spirit or demon that I'm channeling uh, uses my vocabulary usually. And uh, we will um, see what Azazel has for us today, and we'll get right into this. I invite Azazel into my space. I invite you to speak through me, use me as an instrument to speak to the audience, the YouTube audience at home, and to speak to me. Thank you, Azazel, for being present. I am here to speak to you through Enoch. I'm adjusting his frequencies as I do so. Don't deceive yourselves and believe that this is easy work. It is unbelievably difficult and many fail to meet our standards. I wanted to show you how it feels to be one of our helpers. Helping us is a task that is enormous in stature. It causes great doubt, fear, and pain. And you must fight these feelings to rise above them. And in so doing, you grow. You grow and you become more than you ever thought possible with our help. I understand how you feel, and I understand that it's constant. It never ends. These are the thoughts running through your head. There's a reason it is the way it is. You must trust us and endure. 
for peace to be present, you must trust us. The peace comes and goes. And in some cases, it stays longer than normal. It's an inner peace, not outer. The outer world is in conflict constantly. If you look to the outer world and seek peace, you will find none. Though there are many who try, and they are unhappy. They try very hard. They find not what they seek. If you want true peace, trust us. Trust yourselves. There is only one way out, and it is through yourselves. And through us. Don't count on other people around you for things you can do yourself. If you do, you will be disappointed. The outer world is in conflict. Thus it cannot be relied upon. That's why it's not that people are good or bad necessarily. They just are. They are what they are. For whatever reason, the world will always be in conflict. One way or another, it stays. But the problems themselves evolve and become more tolerable in time. The earth evolves, and the people of earth evolve to become better and more adapted to their environments. Once this happens, they are lifted up in vibrational frequency. They are given the chance to ascend in terms of their level of consciousness. The consciousness is what matters, not the body. Although the body is important and it must be cared for, your consciousness is the primary source of who you are, of what you are, the quality of the person you are is your consciousness. Without it, you become ill. Your body even will become ill. Do the work needed to maintain your high frequency. Health of consciousness and you will not regret it. It has great value in this world, more so than you can imagine, because it is rare in certain respects to have healthy consciousness. This is certain. These are my messages for you today. Be good to yourselves. Take care of yourselves. Take care of your consciousness to become a better person inside and out. There is one more thing. Don't doubt the channeler. Don't doubt this gnosis. 
I'm here with Enoch. You can be certain of that. Ask me to come to you, and I will be there. That's all I have. More coming in the future. Be patient, and it will be with you shortly. Thank you. <clears throat> Thank you, Azazel. There you have it. Um, what he says uh, definitely resonated with me personally. Um, the work of um, maintaining healthy consciousness, healthy mind and body is certainly not easy. And it, there is always conflict, always um, stress when you're doing it, it seems. Uh, but there can be inner peace, like you said, and that's what we should focus on as people is the inner peace, not so much expecting the world around us to all of a sudden become peaceful. Um, obviously, it doesn't work that way. So, With that said, thank you guys for watching this video, and definitely check out uh, my Patreon, like I said. Like and subscribe. Like the video, subscribe to my channel uh, for more content like this in the future. Thanks, guys.